Hey guys, Sam here, Giant Pumpkins NZ. Hello, welcome along to this video where I'm just talking a little bit about the end of the giant pumpkin growing season. Hopefully the weather's okay where you are and it's all about what you need to be doing with your giant or tiny pumpkin patch right now. For me, that is removing all the junk and weeds that I have in the tiny patch, getting rid of these compost bags, moving them to the back and things like that. So how did the season go? Well for me I was pretty happy with what I ended up with. Jerry weighed in at 92 kilos. Now he was cut off the vine about two weeks uh, earlier than what he should have been and I've got a little bit of video explaining what happened, why I did that and what actually the stem looked like when I cut it which was a bit different so check that out. Basically I'm worried about the stem. I think it's going to have uh, a bit of softness in there and I don't like that if it gets into the cavity game over now you should have seen the blog post on Facebook and Instagram but I've already chopped the pumpkin off Jerry's off the vine but uh, I'm making sure I'm doing this now because I am worried about it and the reason I'm worried about it is because Tim's just lost his big pumpkin uh, he weighed it today 858 kilos which would have made a new New Zealand record it was still growing, he may have been able to get to the magical 907 kilos that he's chasing, which is the 2,000 pound mark. But, uh, so I'm going to try and keep this pumpkin intact for another 12 days, we'll see how we go. This is where I uh, cut it the other day, there was some softness around here, um, but it's hard to show you, but um, underneath about there, so I think I'm going to try and chop it. Uh, wish me luck. Uh, so I've chopped it and I was expecting this to be more solid. I don't know really what I was expecting to be honest But uh, I've got this bit and a hole and I don't think it goes right into the pumpkin But uh, I've probably Increased the chances of there now being a very big problem uh, Probably not good for my part, but I'm going to coat all that hopefully cover that and we will There's a bit of softness there Mm. Here's some of the softness that I was worried about, and in here you'll see the uh, the bit that was connected to the vine. Hmm, interesting. No New Zealand record was broken this year. I think the heaviest would have been 596. Alex Harris's pumpkin. Tim's failed. He had a bad season, first time for him. So uh, it doesn't matter what you're up to things can just go wrong and you never know how it's going to go. Now is a great time to reflect upon what went well and what didn't in your season. So for me I'm not going to bore you with all those details right here but I do have a very detailed blog post. Check out giantpumpkins.co.nz forward slash blog and you will see the end of season right up. I go through everything that worked really well for me, everything that didn't work well for me and the areas that I want to improve on uh, next season. So please check that out and uh, let me know in the comments either on the website or on Facebook uh, how your season went. Okay, that's about it for this video. I will have a video hopefully very soon for you. Another one uh, talking about things that you should be possibly thinking about and maybe some possible changes happening around here. I'm not too sure, but uh, I'll let you know when that's ready. Uh, make sure to come check me out on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, or just go check out the website giantpumpkins.co.nz for all the information and everything that I'm up to. Thanks for watching and uh, if you think any of this is valuable or could be of help someone, please share it, let them know or go check out Patreon and see how you can help me create more content to give to you. Okay, thanks for that, see ya.